Pisces. Wow, welcome Pisces. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Wow, Pisces. All right, Pisces. Some emotional problems you were dealing with is going to be coming to an out soon. This is going to be very good. Um, you are coming in this series uh, um, with Saturn uh, in Pisces. Okay, this is what you're coming in this month with Saturn in Pisces. And with this situation, Pisces, this looks good. Okay, because this is your reading. All right, this is your reading, Pisces. And uh, with the situation that you're coming in with this period, it is about the Eight of Cups. And the Eight of Cups, you know that Pisces is always about you. It is always good. Okay, it is always whatever the energy of the Eight of Cups comes out is Saturn in Pisces. And uh, uh, this whatever that was going on um, is now over. Okay, so Saturn came in and bring back discipline. Um, it is now in the reverse. So it's, uh, um, there is no ending. The, the situation has been dealt with. And uh, this is going to be good. So it's as if this month of May, you're going to be dealing with some situation that was open and left undone. And you're going to be finally resolving this uh, situation. As we look at the first week again, um, there is going to be... Uh, a situation where you're going to be continuing um, and moving forward. I see the energy of the world. Um, you know, you're going forward where um, it's as if a new business that you have started or some sort of a new business association. And this is going to be good. I see, you know, the quarrels, um, the conflicts. It could be button heads trying to find out some sort of a creative situation. Uh, the energy of the world is here and it's as if uh, you are going to be getting a new ch um, chance um, in life, in a new business association. I see a lot of you um, are open to some sort of a new business association um, with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, some of you. Um, could be going in business with this person. Some of you could be hoping that this person, um, you know, uh, offer you a new uh, position, that sort of a thing. But uh, um, whoever this um, this energy is, uh, um, it is an energy where money. This is the Empress energy, and it's all about the money. All right, it's all about the money, and I see that a lot of you. Pisces are going to be opening up um, the manifestation. And um, a lot of you are really open um, for some sort of a new start. And that this new start and this new offer is going to be what, it, what you had hoped for. Whatever conflicts that was there, Pisces, because... Uh, there is some sort of a conflict in the in the second week. Uh, um, there could be some sort of a conflict, so, but not to worry because I see whatever this conflict is. You know, there is. Uh, it's just that um, you know people are not the same. They don't see eye to eye. Um, that sort of a situation, and whatever the conflict is, not to worry about this. Okay, um, this resin. This conflict is going to be resolved. Um, right now you are not showing any love to anyone. Um, it is as if you are focusing and finding and loving your own self in the sense of, uh, it is like loving the things that you want to do, you know, focusing on what you prefer to do. So you are, you know, it is not about love. It is about business. It's about work. It is about, uh, a business that you are doing so it's as if you have um have some sort of a new offer that is going to be coming in um in the third week take this new offer it is going to be good in the fourth week you are dealing with the king of swords who is this king of swords and whatever is transpiring in the fourth week i see this king of swords is going to be getting some sort of a new start 
and this is going to be good because a lot of you it could be a boss um that is going to be offering you some sort of a um, promotion or um some sort of an offer it could be coming up for you pisces mm. oh uh-huh so be aware of this pisces mm. wow be aware of this pisces that some sort of a new offer could be coming up for you pisces in the last week so it took that's the second week in the last week okay who to be aware of um be aware of the Librans, the Aries, and the Aquarian, Geminis, and Libran. A lot of you could be having some sort of a um, short words coming at you, but you know, at the end of the week, whoever this Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra is, it's, it's okay because you know, um, you are going to be getting some sort of a new start, and you there's no need to worry. Okay, so understand that you have to be aware and alert and aware of what is going on and um pisces this is going to be a new story that is going to be coming up take this new offer that a capricorn is trying to offer you something take it okay you're very um you have some sort of a competition that is going on pisces i will tell you something don't try competition with um capricorns because i see that this capricorn is really opening up and is letting you on their business okay and you don't understand is as if one is creative one is a creative person or one is but you know whoever this person is they're they're opening up a new world for you okay whatever this uh, um whatever this person is offering you whether it's partnership in a business partnership uh um at the workplace partnership however this is transpiring um you know you like to be in content and competition but i'm telling you pisces you will never get an offer like this again never okay pisces i'm telling you never and uh, a whole lot of you are not aware of uh, that you do good business with Capricorns. And do you know why? It's because um, Capricorns are the opposite of you. Um, because people keep on recognizing. You got to understand. Doing business with. Because you're both hard working. You are both going for the same thing. And I see that you uh, Pisces are very conflicting. Stop. Stop. Something is being offered to you. Take it and don't try to. Oh, but you know, and this don't try to push and push and put pressure um, because you might lose this offer. OK, because this person is someone that will uh, there. They will open up and they will help you and they will try to push you up a lot. Of, but whenever you try to push too hard, this person will back away and let you fall on your face okay so i would advise you capricorn um taurus is um a taurus some of you a taurus and a capricorn is going to be trying to help you up the ladder do not push too hard and don't push um like um you know you should do it like this if you start doing that this these people are going to be stepping back and so it's an it's like starting a new job. You don't know who people are. Uh, you gotta take your time. Do not jump um and push yourself forward. Stand back, look at the play, and recognize. You know, keep your own opinion to yourself. Keep your own opinion to yourself. Okay. Keep your own opinion to yourself. And whatever the offer is. Take the offer that is coming up in the second week because, again, ladies and gentlemen, this is an offer of a lifetime. This is a position of a lifetime. Take it, all right? In the last week, some of you are going to be getting some sort of a good news from your boss. Uh, some of you are really working together with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person. I see that this person are going to be offering you some sort of a new position, um, some of you, okay? 
So um, be open for this. The center is about making money in this uh, um, period. The spirit is about making money. And if you notice, uh, Saturn in Pisces, meaning you're going to be dealing with some with a Capricorn that is going to be helping you to bring back some sort of a balance and stability in your world. So be aware of this. All right. I really do love you guys. Just uh, take it easy, whatever the conflicts is and whatever is going on. Some of you, um, um, Pisces businessman is going to be having some sort of a conflict with your business partner. Be aware of this. This is going to be coming out. Whatever problem there is with a business partner, whatever is transpiring, I see some of you are going to be having some serious problem with a business partner. you got to be aware of this. So, it is better to keep um, keep the peace, whatever is happening, keep the peace, um, um, Pisces, and hope for the best. Because there is some positive uh, um, opportunities that is going to be coming in for you, Pisces. A whole lot of positive opportunities. And do not waste this moment, Pisces. Sometimes these um, moments come in once in a lifetime. So um, take it. Okay, and work with it. Um, I got to say that I got to go. But remember to um, share, subscribe. A new start is coming up. Some real positive situation is going to be transparent. And a real new start is coming up. Take it, run with it. Saturn has brought back discipline in your life. This is good. Run with it. I want to say thank you for being here. Namaste.